Hey, I am Dave Odd, stand-up comedian and political debater extraordinaire on Facebook. Um, recently, the climate uh, climate change debate came up, and a lot of conservatives like to use uh, this 31,000 scientists list that all deny that climate change is happening. Well, that list is readily available online. It is called the uh, Petition Project. As you can plain well see, let me just make sure we're centered here. Yes. The Petition Project. Uh, and uh, it, it lists all the names of the people that signed it, um, the quote-unquote scientists. Now, the only qualifications of this were that people uh, that signed it had at least a bachelor in science or some sort of scientific uh, uh, credentials in their studies. Um, as you'll see, um, just, just before I even go into Googling these names, there are several people on here, DVM, that's a doctor of veterinary medicine, uh, not at all uh, versed in climate change, and you'll see, I'm just going to do a search on the page for DVMs, just in the A's. So that is, um, okay, so, so far we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, just in the just in the A's, we have ten veterinarians saying that climate change doesn't exist. Okay, that doesn't seem that doesn't seem credible, does it? Do scientists know about climate change? Do they know about climatology? Did they ever study climatology? I, I don't think so. Okay, here Earl Arthur Abramson, Abramson, Ph.D. That sounds that sounds pretty pretty legit, right? Let's uh. Let's check that out. Here's another one that I googled. A Roger A. Altamont, Ph.D., who is a National Cancer Institute um, doctor. Cancer scientist? I don't think cancer scientists know about about that. Okay, here we go. Um, we're going to do Ar Earl Arthur Abramson, Ph.D. Um, hmm. This guy is a medical doctor. Let's see here. Um... Yeah, from what I can see here, he's a medical doctor. Okay, let's try to find another one. Um, and keep in mind, this is just, just the A's. Ernest Charles Alcaraz, Ph.D. There we go. And, and keep in mind, this is just Google. You can, you can do this yourself if you don't believe me. Um... Ernest Charles Alcaraz, Ph.D. A lot of these just go right back to the uh, actual petition project, too. Um, as is this one. There apparently is no information on this person online anywhere. Um, which I don't know what that means. But you're probably not a very good doctor if you don't have a website. Another uh, veterinarian. A lot of veterinarians on here have opinions about that. Okay, here. Um, Mark... J. Alkire, M.D., medical doctor. There we go. Thoracic surgery and general surgery. That doesn't seem doesn't seem to have anything to do with climate, meteorology, or anything, really. And keep in mind, I'm just checking out the Ph.D.s on here. I'm not even char like checking the regular names. Okay, here's another one. Albert W. Alsop, Ph.D. Um, not, not just more global warming websites. Let's see, if take a Ph.D. off of his. Yeah, I don't think this is even a real person. Um, oh, here we go. Biologically. Per uh, something about the purification of biologically produced propanediol. That also doesn't sound climate related. Alright. Well, I hope you get my point here. You can uh, check out the website yourself. Um, petition Project. Um, this is from www.oism.org. Um, I think you can find it on there. Um, but just just to give you an idea, I'm gonna just go randomly to the apps here. Let's let's search for DVMs again. Oh, 
there's another doc doctor of veterinary medicine that has an opinion about climate change, and another one, and another one, and another one, and another one, and another one. Um, you will be hard pressed if you go onto this list and just Google random names to find one information on most of these people, and two, um, anyone that has any degree relating anywhere near to climatology, meteorology, uh, and pretty much anything in that would have anything to do with climate science or geology or anything like that. This essentially breaks down to a list of well-educated conservatives who signed a petition. That's it. Nothing more. Uh, most of these people don't even qualify as scientists. So, uh, next time you say there's 31,000 scientists that deny global warming, it's veterinarians. It's country club white assholes that uh, don't want global warming to be a real thing because it would go against their conservative values. Um, so that is all. Suck it.